Christmas ever! Woo! Hey, boys! Welcome back, baby! I have so much good news for you, so sit back and enjoy. Number one, every single Christmas, we have had a fire December 5th, the whole time to get in that holiday mood. You guys know how butt naked I get every holiday season. Oh my God, dude, just the feeling of Christmas, all of it gets me so amped. You guys know the Gucci Creamy Rope. I wore the Gucci Creamy Rope for like three straight years. But last year, I finally switched it up. I, I had on the Gay Pride Rope. It was a good time, it was a good season. Black Santa made his first ever entrance. But this year, we're switching it up a little bit. This year, we're going with the Gucci Crimmy suit. I wanted to set out to make this the hypest Wheel of Mutt December season that we have ever had. And that's not easy. I've been doing Wheel of Mutt now for, I literally believe, five years. Maybe it's four. I actually have no idea. I think it's four. Either way, it's a challenge. Every year, it's banger after banger after banger. How do we elevate? This is how we elevate! And, and some of you are sitting there, ooh, ooh, Papa Meeks, ooh, I don't celebrate Christmas because, ugh. Jew Llama. Jew Llama. Yeah, good try, bud. Good try. Oh, you thought you'd catch me slipping, Jew Llama. Idiot! You guys might not even notice, Jew Llama's been sitting there in all of December. All of my videos in December, Jew Llama's been there. You didn't even know. Well, what? Ooh, and I have special news for you. You guys know this. This has been a thing most Decembers. I'm not gonna switch up on you now. Last December, I did every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Wheel of Mud. Now you're doing the math in your head, and that feels like it's Wheel of Mud every other day, but it isn't. It's actually only three weeks. So this year, we are actually going Wheel of Mud every other day, obviously starting today. So tomorrow, you'll see a banger. Not Wheel of Mud. Day after, Wheel of Mud. Day after that, banger. Day after that, Wheel of Mud. You get the idea. So you can expect to see See me, Black Santa, Jew Llama, Gucci Christmas suit, absolutely bricked up, igneous, my full three inches on hard, grinding, Madden 22, making other super heat bangers, and just having an amazing time. So I want you guys to feel my appreciation. I do want to emphasize you guys are the best people in the world. If there's anything I can do on top of all this to show my appreciation, please let me know. If there's one thing I can do, let me know. But regardless, I'm gonna keep putting out bangers. I love you guys so much. Let's get this show. Money boy! Now, unfortunately, there's no actual Christmas content in the game yet because I'm recording this on December 4th and I think you guys are seeing it on December 5th. There's still so much to do in Wheel of Mind. We kind of got to prepare ourselves because it's looking like our Super Bowl is going to come around Christmas time. If we've got an episode every other day, depending on whether I make it through the season or not, it's going to be around Christmas time. As we know, every time I get a touchdown with James Robinson, he's going up in overall and he is in a really good spot right now. Our next upgrade puts him at an 82 after that's 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, and then 95. So we need seven touchdowns to fully max out this James Robinson. And last game where we got clapped, we still had three touchdowns with him. It's all looking pretty good. We got two wheel spins. We have an offensive line that is bleeding. Uh, we have a defensive line that's bleeding. And we have a linebacker core that is mediocre. Although Eric Kendricks, dude, for being an 83 overall, I like a beast. All right, boys, our first wheel spin in December. Set the tone. Let's set the tone right here. Get a super eater, and then we know that December is gonna be filled with bangers. Oh my god! Limited jet, dude, 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 dude. There's a 95 overall DeAndre Swift, but I have that James Robinson. Limited jackpot is any limited player in the game. Judon would be rich, dude. Matthew Judon has had such an incredible year this year too. 87 speed, left outside linebacker. That could be the move. Kendall Fuller's another very good option. Bosa's a good option. I think we go Judon here. He'll be the best player on my team, and it's not even close. Matthew Judon, 970k. Matthew Judon, is it crazy that me and this dude? have the same first name. Uh, see, like, I could give him edge threat. Why don't we try it? We'll try edge threat Matthew Judon. I'll also give him unstoppable force. Holy shit. This is the highest overall player on our team. Just got our new absolute best player. Still gotta win this game or complete my challenge wheel to salvage him. All right, our first wheel spin was solid. It set the tone exactly as we went to our second one. I would not mind offensive line, but I don't know if I'll have a choice. It's mama's, Oh, Me and my mom are very similar in that we could talk for literally ever. So let's see how this goes. Mama! How you doing? Very good, how are you? Am I am I bugging you at a bad time? Heck no! It's always a good time when you talk. That's so cute. <laughs> so two things. Number one, you'll have to give a word of advice to all the boys. So you don't have to do that first, but just think of it, okay? All right. And then the only other thing is, can you just give me a random number one through 20? Just whatever you want. Oh, sure. 16. 16. Ooh. 
That actually could be good. Okay, clean. And then your word of advice for the boys. How about never eat yellow snow? <laughs> never eat yellow snow? That's where all the flavor is. Oh my gosh, never do drugs, never do alcohol, for sure. Never do alcohol. I couldn't imagine doing alcohol. All right, well, okay. this is great good. advice. I think the boys are really gonna appreciate this. And do something for your mom for your dad for Christmas. You don't even have to give them a gift, but just do something their day today. Are you saying that to me or to them? To them and to you. I love you. I love you so much. What number did she even say? It was too inspirational for me to even remember. 16. I can take any single player from round 16. I hope all of you put that knowledge into your brain sack. Black Santa Christmas mug. Bro, I was actually shocked. So last year when I was trying to get Black Santa, it was like a special order. I had to go on Amazon and dig to find a Santa who wasn't white. I had to find a Black Santa. I'm going Home Goods this year, Home Goods is just like a furniture store. Basically, your mom probably goes there all the time. In fact, I go with your mom there all the time. I go on Home Goods, literally 80% of the Santa figurines were black. Like it was became difficult to find the white Santas. I don't fucking know. Either way. It was hilarious. Dude, I walked in. First thing I see, Black Santa Christmas mug. He was 15, 16. It's got to be a good round. And my mom just clapped us. Hey, O-line, 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 O-line. Who do I have on my team right now? I genuinely forgot. I think we have a center. We don't have a right guard. Ben Powers. Ben Powers. Let's go. I just got a right guard. Dude, my mom actually clutched up. You guys an O-lineman. All right, Batonio's added to the squad and 96 Judon is on defense with the X Factor. We're 86 overall. Uh, switched up my unis. I'm going with the bow nose white unis and boneyard biohazard dark. Kind of weird, and of course we got Urban Myers, our coach, dude. I don't know if you guys have seen like how Urban Meyer looks in this game, but it is so sad. It's atrocious. It doesn't look anything like it. Pisses me off. I think they don't have a face scan for him, but they need to get one because that's my coach, and he grinds it out, and it pisses me off that he doesn't have. Oh, and by the way, I played RBT on the Game Days channel for this series we're doing called Taking Down the House. Definitely check it out. All right, boys, this is a crucial game. We've got Judon on the line. We are three and three. And the challenge reel is spinning right now. We are going to need... Oh, God. Oh, God. Two bronzes need a touchdown. So it's not even... This is even more difficult than getting the backup touchdowns because your backups can be pretty good. Right now, I have Trey McKitty. That is for sure a bronze. A tight end. He might be the only bronze left on this team. He's got Lamar, Denzel Ward, and Jalen Ramsey. Okay. Let's see how this goes, boys. All right, boys. Uh, read option. Yep. Saw it a little bit late. Wow, I can't believe he didn't go down. A dive up the middle is going to who? So, but he's huge. Who is that? Robert Hunt. Oh, he's a team of the week utility fullback. Big hits. Oh, not big enough. Third and two. Oh, damn. Fred Warner almost just had the pick. It's hard to say what he's going to go for here. He might go read option though. He's got to go deep. Oh. That's so lucky. We were right there. Oh, that is not what I expected. We get another huge hit. We gotta get a fumble. We gotta be so close to a fumble right now. Go get him. Oh, good ball, Lamar. That 94 Lamar is killing me right now. Me and this guy have been talking shit back and forth. Which is a totally random guy, not the guy I'm playing. I played this guy like a week ago. We've been talking shit back and forth, and I think it's finally turned into just friendly banter. He said, quit early just like you. I said, Ligma. He said, trash. I said, re. He said, garbage. I said, sugma. He said, why are you gay? I said, pee pee wiener. I think we're about to become friends, low key. A is kind of there. Oh, what a throw! No! no! That was so sick. Wow, that was so sick. How does he have this momentum already? That's, I hate that. He is up in my grill here. And there's Waller again, I'm pretty sure. Oh, what? They gave him that? Not good. Could be read option again. He hasn't ran in a while. Yup. You know, it's funny, I knew it, but... Oh, nice play. He's got some balls, dude. I'm surprised he's not going down earlier. Third and two. How the fuck? And who is that? Jones? Is that Daniel Jones? Does he have a wide receiver card? Did you catch? Oh, what a savage. He got that. Let's see how this sets up. Ooh, Darren Waller. Was wide open. Denzel Ward caught up real fast, though. Ooh, look at Darren Waller. A little seam beater. I kind of don't want to score right now. Let's see if that old line will hold for James Robinson here, yeah? Oh, my God. 
literally didn't even have a chance. So this is three to 14. I get the ball at half and a touchdown 10 to 14. Regardless, I need to stop. And right now I can't stop this guy. Well, he's got it loaded up again. Oh, that's fine. This game is not very winnable, but we're still gonna go for it. Still need to stop and win somehow. See, there's Waller again. I feel like I could have thrown it early, but since I didn't, it's kind of hard to do it late. Oh, that's such a dumb animation. Yep. Maybe I go for the win. It's definitely still on the table. It's definitely still on the table. That's 10 to 17. I just wish I hadn't thrown that pick earlier in the game. That's what's really putting me in a hole here. No. Oh, I was literally going up to it. I just am not fast enough. I don't know why Daniel Jones has like a 95 speed. He's faster than everybody I got up. Double me activated on Wide receiver Daniel Jones. Oh, he has Truz activated, doesn't he? He doesn't have Truz and he just did that? Are you shitting me? That is frustrating as heck. Wow, he just dove like that without Truz. 24 to 10. I can't stop him, so I need something like a fumble to salvage it. I could beam one up to Darren Waller, but I kind of want to save that for like a really important moment as opposed to just throwing it just to throw it. Like that, just a wide open Darren Waller. He is on Bosa. I'm going up to Waller! Oh, come on, that's what the ability's for. I think he lost the ability now. I was saying I was gonna use it for a good moment and I clearly don't. Just gonna go under to Damian Harris who makes a great move to keep this drive alive. That was third and eight, super clutch. Gonna get around Keekly, and we're gonna slide down for five sketchy yards. I'm going inside zone, Damian Harris. It's not good for the clock if we don't get it, so let's just pray we get it right here. Damian Harris, oh, I need James Robinson for that. Wow, I'm off my game right now. I should've put James Robinson in for that. At the very least, I could've upgraded him. <laughs> get up and pick the fucking ball up! If that's a safety, I'm turning my Xbox off. I just single covered Daniel Jones and he mossed me. I literally couldn't commentate because I was so pissed off. Well, it's a game again. We must perfectly utilize this clock. There's Damian Harris for a beautiful first down. What do I click when I have to go for two here? Cause I'm not going into OT with this guy. He's gonna massacre me. No shot I beat this guy in OT. He's been killing me all game. The only reason I even have a chance is he tried to showboat there. This is a, let this be a lesson, boys. If I win this game, let it be a lesson as to why he don't showboat. I'm staying in cross drag because he can't stop it right now. Let's see if he stays with Waller. Still doesn't stay with Waller. That gives Waller another chance to go for 10. There has to be no time on the clock. Dude, did you see how quickly he kicked that last field goal? I had to score with literally five seconds max. All right, he stays with it this time. That leaves Jalen Rager. And there's Jalen Rager once again, who just rolled his ass for what is, I believe now, not a first. Oh no. Rager! Oh my God, it's fourth and inches. What the fuck? There's 21 seconds. He dropped that first one and he rolled back the second one. You know, I might just run inside zone here, actually. This should be guaranteed. Oh my God, he ran commit. What a play. He ran commit. What a fucking play. Jalen Rager just sold that game that we were about to actually go win. Even even still, I had to score and get the two point. I uh, I think I might quick sell Jalen Rager and put in a bronze after this. <laughs> That's not a fumble! I just hit stick to Lamar Jackson with Sean Taylor. I am mad, no lie. That felt really unlucky. Jalen Rager. I'm quick selling. I'm literally quick selling Jalen Rager. It was still a good game. That guy outplayed the hell out of me. I shouldn't have even had a chance. The only reason I had a chance was because he tried showboating. 11 for 203 though. I've never had a challenge that's 200 plus receiving yards with a player. In fact, I don't think I've ever thrown for 200 plus receiving yards with a single player. Darren Waller just did it. You know, that's not really in the rules of Wheel of Mud anywhere that you can just discard players, but um, I'm gonna do it. We just got booted. We're back to the regular season. We're zero and zero, but we only reset 
with our team if we make the playoffs. Which makes sense, because if I can't make the playoffs, why would my team reset? Jalen Rager, you are literally getting quick sold. Jalen Rager. Oh, uh, a thousand. Th you know, that's too much. He's not worth that much. He's worth more like this is a more accurate price for Jalen. Only thing I'm sad about is saying goodbye to Matthew Judon, but you know what? He had no impact. I was bringing him off the edge every single time. And that's not true. I was bringing him off the edge about half the time. He never got a sack. So I am sad to lose a 96 overall linebacker, but he wasn't exactly impactful. So then by Tony, I'm just sad because my mom picked him. Hey boys, I love you. Brand new season, zero and zero. It's technically possible that I could get a Super Bowl on Christmas or like right before. It's possible. We'll see if we can make it there. I love you boys. I'll see you in the next videos. Peace.